Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, thanks for joining. I'm Julia Rose and today I am talking about spring outerwear because if like me and you've put all your winter coats away, I'm very excited about the sun and it's getting a little bit warmer, but it's still a little chilly and I don't need those full coats, but what I do need is a light outerwear to take out and about and I've got my collection here to show you in case you need any ideas for spring. And you know a lot of these work for, well for autumn as well, those transitional seasons. So don't worry, you'll get plenty of wear out of them. I'll list everything down below. A lot of them are old, but I'll list similar items, or if I can find the same item but pre-loved, I'll list that as well. Hit that subscribe button because I would love to have you back. Give the video a thumbs up if you like it, and let's get started. Okay, I'm gonna start off with my new favorite. Yes, I know I said a lot of these pieces were old. This is my newest piece and I am in love. I bought it the other day in London because exactly that. I went out a little overzealous for the sunshine and I was actually freezing. So I bought this and it's perfect. Excuse me. Of course it's camel. I love camel. Um, I saw it in other stories and I just thought, oh my gosh, that is gorgeous. It's the perfect weight. It's lightweight but cozy because it's padded and insulated and I just love it. The tie waist is just so chic but also really cool. I was wearing leather leggings and leather biker boots and it looked really cool when I was wearing it but also it looks really cute with jeans and a white tee. So it's super versatile. You can dress it up, dress it down and I just really like this. It's so cozy, so comfy, slightly oversized and I just love this. I love the length. I love the collar. It's super cozy. I just want to put it on right now, but I won't. Also, it's machine washable. I popped it in because I've been wearing it to death. I put it in the washing machine the other day and it's come out perfect. I didn't tumble it, um, even though I think you can tumble dry this. I just let it air dry and it's perfect. So I'm so happy with that. That's a really easy option. And like I said, this is perfect for autumn as well if you want to wear it in autumn. And you know what? I reckon you can get away with this in winter. Throw some sweaters underneath and poof, you got yourself a kind of fabulous extra layer. Cannot recommend this enough. A piece that I have shown you guys before but I cannot get enough of and I cannot recommend more is this little jacket from H&M. I love it. It's so chic. I get compliments on it every time I wear it. A bunch of my friends have bought it. It's so cute. The tie waist is awesome. I love how it's hidden in the back. So it gives a really chic back silhouette. I change it out for my own belt if I think that it would look cuter for the outfit that I'm trying to accessorize. And I just love this collarless collar. I think it's just so cool. It gives a total vibe and I'm just so into this. I love the light camel beige color and the sleeve, everything. I just, it's so easy. It's so easy. It's one of those things where you're like, I have nothing to wear. Oh, jeans, white t-shirt, this, and you're like, oh gosh, actually I look really cute today. Love this. All right guys, how do we feel about tassels? Because they are everywhere, as I think our cowboy boots are on their way. And I think there's this whole like kind of Western vibe coming back. I bought this years ago and I love it. It's just fun, isn't it? Tassels are fun. They add a little edge to your outfit, um, but they don't have to be so crazy. You don't have to go nuts with the studs. In fact, when I wear this outfit, I make sure the tassels are the only thing that's going on in my outfit. So this jeans white top, Combo is perfect because you just let the tassels do the talking and I wouldn't want to distract from those. Um, but these, this is just so fab. This is from Zara. It's suede, it's so comfy, and it's just fun and cool and a little wacky and a little out there, but you know what? We've been locked up for years with COVID and I say, if you want to have fun with your fashion, go for it because now is the time to wear everything you wish you could wear and it's the first spring where I feel like I get to actually really dress up. There was COVID and then I had the baby and I couldn't really fit in anything and now I'm going a little wild west. See what I did there? I might edit that out. The light coat is a dangerous coat because you know stains, marks, dirt, ketchup, coffee, and everything in between, but oh, when you get it right, it is so chic. And what I mean when I say is when you get it right is that there are so many light coats out there that are just bad. My advice when buying a light coat is 
to really push the boat out when it comes to the material because if you have a cheap light coat it just looks wrong and make sure it doesn't look like a doctor's coat so I really like this form-fitting kind of elegant sexy coat it's got these slits and it just looks more fashion than doctor you know what I mean? Um, this one's from Reese. Again, the collarless collar is just so gorgeous on this. Pre-loved is such a good way to go for these coats. You know, one trip to the dry cleaners and they're back to brand new. And also you get that gorgeous fabric for not the price point, which is amazing. I just love this coat, honestly. This is definitely a spring autumn winter vibe and I love it so much it just goes you can really dress this down with jeans and trainers I just love this so much I highly recommend one don't go bright bright white go for an accru or a cream or this one has some gray tones in it um, because I think they are just much easier to wear but this is fabulous and I love this so much I wish I wore it more but I always have my kids with me so that's just like danger zone you know and if a light coat sounds like the worst idea ever then how about a colorful coat i think this blue is just gorgeous i got this from river island years ago and i love it it's a little bit different but i think if you're going to go for a color of a coat this blue is a really good idea because it goes with jeans and a t-shirt but it also really goes with browns and camels obviously um any kind of a crew white color. I just love this color coat. I know Zara's doing one at the minute. I'll try and find some other links because I'm sure River Island aren't doing this one anymore. Um, but if I, my advice for a colorful coat is again, let the color do the talking, do kind of like a plain style, nothing too crazy, nothing too wacky when you're going for a colored coat because let the color do the talking and the styling and let the chic silhouette of your coat also just allow that color to be the centerpiece of your outfit. The trench coat. Every wardrobe should have one in my opinion and they're not going anywhere. The trench coat has been in people's wardrobes for years and I just think a classic trench is fantastic. This is a vintage Burberry one and it is full length. I mean it's totally totally oversized. It's way too big for me but I love that because a few scrunches of the arms, a cinched in waist and it gives this elegant kind of dress coat vibe which I love. You can find these all over pre-love sites and I just love them. The quality is gorgeous, the way they fit is amazing and I just love, love, love this coat so much. Most high street shops will also do an elegant longer style trench coat. I'll list them all down, well not all of them down below. I'll find some great options and list them down below for you. Have a little click around and see what you like. But I just think a camel classic trench, you cannot go wrong. Throw some big sunnies, heels, sneakers, jeans, trousers, a skirt, whatever, throw it over a dress. It's just perfect. With a cute little umbrella, you are ready for spring. The denim jacket. Again, every wardrobe should have one in my opinion, and this one is a classic from Levi's. Also, I know I'm wearing Levi's jeans, so it's kind of, I mean, it's a look. It's a choice to do the denim on denim. Uh, side note, these ribcage jeans that I'm wearing do things for my butt that I had no idea were possible. I cannot, cannot recommend these enough, plus they show off every cute shoe that you put on. I love them. I have worn them so much. So I will also list these jeans below because they're amazing. Anyways, if you would pair them with a denim jacket is another story. I don't know if I would go out in the denim on denim. Maybe if I was feeling a little brave that day. But this is just a perfect classic denim jacket. It fits so well. If you're looking for one, Levi's do a really good quality, great fit denim jacket. This is the classic denim jacket and I love it. Oh, I have a love, a love for my Abercrombie denim jacket. I had it since I was 16, and then I had too many drinks in a bar a few years ago and left it in there, and I was devastated because I, it had been with me forever, and I wore it pretty much every day, I feel like, and that's it. A good denim jacket stands the test of time, doesn't wear down, and fits with, like, every outfit. I swear to God. Also, if you're feeling like a little too dressed up for an occasion, chuck a denim jacket on and it really just whew, brings it down a notch and maybe puts you in a bit more of a comfortable space. 
magical, these denim jackets, I swear to God. The Light Blazer. Well, you know I love a blazer, and I've had this one for years, and I have worn it so much. It's an H&M, it wasn't too expensive, but it fits like a glove, and I absolutely adore it. The light color is perfect for spring. It's lined, so it's a great warmer layer. What's hair? It's a great warmer layer for those chilly days and also it's just casual it's got a casual vibe it's not one of these goodness gracious it's not like a work blazer that makes you feel a little overdressed it's a very cute but chilled out blazer because of the texture the material and it's just so easily done I've worn this with leather leggings and boots I've worn it with jeans and trainers I've also worn it with heels so well, I mean, trousers and heels, not just heels. It's not, you know, that kind of blazer. It could be. Love a blazer. I'll put some options down below. Have a click around. <sighs> the puffer. I mean, they are back with a vengeance, and I love it. It is such a comfy, oh my god. It's such a comfy jacket so cozy but not long like a winter jacket so you can still get away with a pair of jeans and trainers and it's still got a spring vibe especially this lighter color this one's from Reese and it just feels nice I don't feel fuddy I don't feel duddy I just feel like it's a cute jacket that I can put on get cozy but also because of the wool and the how chic this one is I don't feel underdressed I just think it's a really cute layer so Definitely a good option. This would also take you through winter and autumn as well, and I just love it. Look at the higher end high street shops uh, because they will look nicer with your outfits. Um, but if you buy it pre-loved, then obviously you don't get that crazy price point. But I just love this one so much. I wear it all the time. Super cozy, super cute for those cash vibes. You can also, do you know what I love about this? You can also pair it with something like cashmere sweatpants and trainers and still look put together. Love it. And last but not least, we have the leather jacket. I have had this one for over 10 years, which just goes to show when you get the right one, it just stays with you forever. I got this from Zara, it was in the sale. I could not believe how lucky I was. It's real leather, which I would highly recommend because it lasts a lot longer. I've shown you that oversized one from H&M recently, which I loved, which has total Anin Bing vibes. I'll definitely list that one below as well. And I just think a good leather jacket is so key. It just kind of rocks up your floral dresses, it sexes up that jeans and t-shirt vibe, and I just love it. Also, you can dress, I wear this out to dinner sometimes if I just need to bring my outfit down a notch. I just think it's such a cute, stylish way to zhuzh up your outfit. A leather jacket, black leather jacket. Mm. And that's it you guys, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to have a little click around down below. Please get in touch if you have any questions. Hit that subscribe button and I'll see you later.